Hey, Sid. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Welcome to the family. Hallelujah. Let's tap on the screen. Let's share the live broadcast. Hallelujah. This is our first session on this Saturday, 1st of July. Hallelujah. You love her, right? She's amazing. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Welcome, Mara Official. Let's do what we do best. We share, we populate the kingdom of God. We depopulate heaven, uh, hell rather, and we populate heaven. Let's make sure we get more people in the room. Share the live broadcast with at least five people. Make sure the gospel reaches somebody this morning. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We meet again, Overcomer. Let's get more people in the room. Let's step on the on the on the screen while you enjoy the worship. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Rusata kalabasata kadiabasata. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody thank the Lord. Thank the Lord for the month of July. Let's just keep praising him and thank him for the month of July. Welcome to the month of July, everybody. Welcome to your month of perfection. Tell somebody I'm perfected in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Say, say to somebody, I'm perfected. I'm perfected in Jesus' name. Of a righteous man availeth much. We have entered July. We have entered it. Hallelujah. My God. Jesus. Yes, Lord. If you have someone who will lift you up in prayer, Amen. Amen. Trust me, it will avail concerning you. Amen. Oh, Hallelujah. And indeed, you have come to the protocol breaking prayer altar. You have somebody who's ready to lift you up in prayer. Somebody shout in the comment section, I'm perfected in Jesus. We live and breathe prayer here. We live and breathe prayer. We are perfected in the name of Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. We are going to war in the spirit. Hallelujah. We've just come out of a very awesome session. Hallelujah. We have been warring in the spirit. And right now, we just want to glorify God. We're going to command our way into the month of July once more time. Hallelujah. I'm perfected in Jesus. Come on, somebody. Tell somebody I'm perfected in Jesus. Father, I thank you. Whoever dwells in the secret place of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. This morning, we are resting in the shadow of the Almighty. We are resting in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say to the Lord, He is my refuge and He is my fortress in whom I will trust. Thank you, Jesus. As we have entered into our month of perfection, welcome Facebook, welcome YouTube, welcome everybody on TikTok. Those of you who are seeing me for the first time, my name is Fortune. I'm from South Africa, Pretoria. My name is Pastor Fortune on TikTok, Fortune L Online on all social media channels. Thank you so much for following already those of you who are coming to be part of the family. Here we pray, we live prayer, and we get results. Amen, somebody. So we're going to pray our way into July. Are you guys ready? Somebody say, I'm perfected in Jesus. We're going to pray our way into July. We're going to command the month like never before in Jesus' mighty name. I'm perfected in Jesus. I'm perfected in Jesus. Oh God, thank you, Lord. As I enter this month of perfection, Father, I declare and I decree that favor locates me. Talk to me, somebody. Somebody say, I'm perfected in Jesus. I'm perfected in Christ. And as I'm perfected in Christ, favor is going to locate me. I decree and I declare in the month of July, favor will locate you. Mercy will locate you. 
God is not an abandoned project. We are not abandoning God. We are stepping into the month of July, still proclaiming his lordship, still proclaiming his, 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 his we're exalting him. We shout hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Let that morning dew announce your worship. Let it announce your perfection in Jesus' mighty name. The same way that dew falls every single morning. If you watch the trees, they never lack dew. You find them wet as you rise this morning. May you experience the same dew from heaven. Hallelujah. Somebody say, I need the dew from heaven to move. I need the dew of heaven to move. Let the dew of heaven move for me in the month of July. You need the dew of heaven to activate in your life. The dew of heaven is activating. God bless you, lady man, in Jesus' mighty name. There's no way our lives can manifest without the dew of heaven. Hallelujah. I need the dew of heaven this morning. Let the dew of heaven fall on me in Jesus' mighty name. Let the dew of heaven move for me. My God. Hallelujah. Your head is the center of your destiny. The dew must fall on your head. The dew of heaven must fall on your head. Let the dew of heaven fall on your head. Let the dew of heaven bring favor to your head. Your destiny is receiving favor this morning in Jesus' mighty name. When you are favored, it means that the dew of heaven has fallen on your head. My God. And the dew of heaven, the Holy Spirit is saying to us this morning, that as the dew of heaven is falling on our heads, it's also falling on our helpers. You are going to find favor with your helpers as we step in into the month of July. Your helpers have no choice but to come through and bless you. Somebody say, I'm perfected in Jesus. When you are a carrier of the dew of heaven, he puts your matter into the heart of people that are meant to help you. So your prayer, your opening prayer is to say, God, put my matters in the hearts of people that are meant to help me. Put my heart, my matters in the heart of people that are supposed to help me. In this month of July, let my destiny helpers expedite helping me. In Jesus' mighty name, let the Jew of heaven identify with me this morning. Let it fall upon me. Let, let me receive what is rightfully mine in Jesus' mighty name. Let it speak for you concerning your issues. We are receiving the blessing this morning. Before the sun rise, before the sunset, for as many as will grab the blessing in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. 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 Akura bashata kadia basata. Somebody say, I'm perfected in Jesus. I'm perfected in Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. Thank you for everybody who's connecting. I'm perfected in Jesus. Hallelujah. Nothing can be released except the Lord releases it. Nothing can be released except God touches the heart of a man's heart. So we are praying this morning and saying, God, touch the hearts of the men that are supposed to release what is due to us. Whoever is my destiny helper that is holding what is due to me. Father, touch their hearts this morning. Make, the, make my matter matter to them. Let my destiny helper be touched by my matter. Let my, my, my matter be expedited this morning. Touch the hearts of the men and women who are supposed to come through and favor me and bless me in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. My God. Somebody is listening to me and saying, some people are qualified more than me. But the Holy Spirit says, I must tell you, it's not in the qualifications. But it is in the mercy and the favor that will speak for you in this month of July in the name of Jesus Christ. I am Brenda J. The month of July. It is the favor and the mercy of God that will pray for you in Jesus' mighty name. It will speak for you. Your prayer should be for mercy and favor. And for that perfection that he's bringing, you see it in the name of Jesus Christ. God touch the hearts of people who are supposed to bless me and favor me in this month of July. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, Lord. Release what is due to me in Jesus' mighty name. 
Who is that helper who's supposed to step up? Who is that helper who's supposed to come through and bless me? Hallelujah. The same way that the devil is speaking to the hearts of certain people who are meant for your destruction, that God needs to be uh, uh, told that God speak to the hearts of the men that are supposed to bless me. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, release the dew of heaven upon every single person who's at the sound of my voice this morning. I speak to everybody on Facebook. Chido, I see you. I see you guys on YouTube. I see you guys on TikTok as well. Father, release the dew of heaven upon every area on our lives in this month, in the month, in the month of July. In Jesus' mighty name. Father, we call on the God of heaven this morning. We ask you that you release your favor in our lives in this month, in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we ask that the God of heaven puts our matter in the minds and in the hearts of those who are supposed to help us, in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Father, we arise with your power this morning. We ask that you destroy anything that will work against our favor in this month of July. By the blood of Jesus, we destroy every polluter upon our lives. Anybody who will try to pollute the minds or the hearts of our destiny helpers, Father, we destroy it in Jesus' mighty name. By the blood of Jesus Christ any power, anywhere, wherever it is located, wherever it is coming from, from every satanic hold in Jesus' mighty name, we are rooted in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Any power that is trying to distract us this month of July or that is trying to withhold our possessions or withhold our benefits in this month of July, my God, may it receive double failure. I decree and I declare that we will not fail in the month of July in Jesus' mighty name. We refuse to be under any satanic authority of any form. In the month of July, Father, I decree and I declare the blood of Jesus. I shout it seven times and it will fight my battles for me in the month of July. In this second part of the year, the blood of Jesus shall speak for me. 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 Come on, shout it out loud. The blood of Jesus shall speak for me. The blood of Jesus shall speak for me in this second part of July. My God, everything concerning my life shall be perfected in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of the Father, and in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit, everything concerning your life shall be perfected. Favor will not be a scarce commodity for you, but favor will locate you in Jesus' mighty name. I decree and I declare that you will not lack anything that is good in the month of July. In the month of July, mercy will favor you in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Your helpers are locating you in the month of July. Hallelujah. I decree and I declare you will not lack financially, you will not lack spiritually, you will not lack physically, you will not lack academically in the month of July. You will not lack of any good thing in Jesus' mighty name. Come on, saints, I need you to shout, shout out a loud and resounding amen. I need you to thunder that amen in Jesus' name. See the dew of heaven is falling upon you, and when the dew of heaven falls upon your life, your life will move to the next level. You are definitely shifting to the next level. Seven is the number of perfection. Hallelujah. God has perfected it. You are moving into a perfection level hallelujah you will not lack favor you will not lack mercy you will not lack grace in jesus mighty name oh thank you jesus as the dew of heaven falls upon your head your life is moving on to the next level in jesus name as trees never lack dew, your destiny will never lack dew. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I declare and I decree that the remaining part of this year shall be better than the rest of the start. Anybody that is thinking negatively upon you, they will receive the judgment of God. Yes, Lord. Anyone that has consulted any satanic oracle concerning your life will receive the fire of God. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, as we, as we are here, Lord, seeking your face, I decree and I declare everybody who has risen this morning to seek your face, Lord, they are not permitted to lack any good thing. I prophesy good things are coming your way in the month of July in Jesus' name. My God, you will live long in prosperity. I decree you will live long in good health in Jesus' mighty name. You need to understand that Psalms 91 verse 1 to 2 is not for everybody. 
It's for the children of God. The scripture makes us known that we are due for a reward. Let me read it again so that you understand it. It says, whoever dwells in the shelter of the most high God will rest in the shadow of the almighty. That means you will be relaxed. You will, you will, you are entering your month of rest. It says, I will say to the Lord, he is my refuge and he is my fortress, my God in whom I trust. Come on, somebody. He's your refuge and he's your fortress. Only if you are a child of God. If he's your father, he's your refuge and he's your fortress. Hallelujah. You cannot be in the God life and not enjoy good things in life. So I speak good things that will manifest in your life in Jesus' mighty name. The same way that God told Sarah that you will have a son and she laughed. And finally, God gave her a child. May God give you laughter this month of July. May God give you that thing that you have been believing, that you have conceived, that you want to give birth to in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. That thing you have been waiting for, that thing that you have been believing for. Hallelujah. In the month of July, you are not permitted to be sick. You are not permitted to be poor. Father, we close the doors of poverty. We close the doors of sickness. It cannot touch us in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. We are soaked in the blood of Jesus. Witches cannot touch us in the name of Jesus Christ. Every satanic witch that wants to suck our blood, my God, trouble them. We close that door in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we prophesy into our month of July. We declare that we will not lack any good thing in Jesus' mighty name. Father, I thank you. As I rise, Lord, I rise to command the month. I rise to command the week. I rise to command this day in Jesus' mighty name. Father, I decree and I declare that we take authority of this day. We take authority of this month in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, every element of our month will cooperate with our purpose and destiny in Jesus' mighty name. We declare and we decree that today is a new day. It is a dawning of a new day. This is the season that we are going to see frustration flee from our lives in the name of Jesus Christ. We decree and we declare that failure is over in our lives. Father, we decree and we declare that we walk in our season of success. We are walking in our season of prosperity in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, I decree and I declare to everybody listening to the sound of my voice uh, that old things have passed away and all things have become new. And Lord, we are going to experience the newness of life in Jesus' mighty name. Father, today as we have risen, my God, we press towards the mark of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus anything or anyone that has been assigned to undermine us anyone that has been assigned to frustrate us anything or anyone that has been assigned to hinder us or to hurt us my god we command them to be moved out of our sphere of influence in the name of jesus christ anybody who wants to undermine us in our workplaces father move them out of our sphere of influence in jesus mighty name we command a newness. This is a new dawning. Hallelujah. Lord, we command our month of July to be fully cooperative with your plan and purpose that you have for our lives in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we greet the 1st of July as we greet this day, my God, with great anticipation of the good things that you're going to send our way in Jesus' mighty name. The good things that you have prepared for us in the month of July, my God, we take possession of it in Jesus' mighty name. I decree and I declare that this is a new dawning for you in Jesus' mighty name. Weeping may have lasted for a night, but joy has come for you this morning. This dawning of this new morning, you are receiving good things in Jesus' mighty name. The Lord is loading you with benefits every single day and every single day of, of the month of July. You will receive daily benefits in Jesus' mighty name. Oh my God, Father, we download success right now. We download success in our jobs, in our businesses, in our finances, oh God. We speak to our finances in the month of July, my God. We declare a new day has dawned for our ministry. 
A new day has dawned for our finances. A new day has dawned for our families. A new day has dawned for our relationships. A new day has dawned for our health in Jesus' mighty name. We download success. We download prosperity. We download health, oh God. We download every single form of wealth, oh God, that you are releasing to us in Jesus' mighty name. We download vision, oh God. Clarity of vision for everybody who's at the sound of my voice in Jesus' mighty name. We download creativity. We download every form of spiritual growth in Jesus' mighty name. We declare and we decree that in the month of July, we are walking in holiness in Jesus' mighty name. We download righteousness from heaven right now in Jesus' mighty name. We decree and we declare, Lord, we will walk in the righteousness of God. We decree and declare, God, that we will have peace that surpasses all understanding on all the days of the month of July in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we thank you, Lord, that you have empowered us, that we have resourcefulness. We are resourceful, everything that we need for every project, for everything that we need to function at the junction, my God. Thank you for releasing it in Jesus' mighty name. We download everything from the Holy Spirit that we need right now into this day, oh God, into this month, into this new week as we step into it in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we declare that we come with a fresh joy, a fresh excitement in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we come with a fresh mind. We say, load us with new ideas, fresh ideas in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we have come with a fresh zeal. Lord, anoint us afresh, O oh God. We have come with a fresh zeal, O oh God. Assign us afresh, O oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we declare and we decree that we have a fresh anointing. And this fresh anointing is uncontaminated in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we rise this morning and we step into the month of July with a fresh anointing that is uncompromised in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We will not compromise who we are. We will not compromise the standard that you have set for us in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. By this anointing that we are moving in in the month of July as we are being perfected, my God, that anointing will break every burden and every yoke that is coming our way. Lord, we declare that as we are being perfected in Christ, oh God, that the burden is lifted, oh God. The yoke is broken. The yoke is removed. The yoke is easy, easy. We decide to take on your burden, God, because your burden is lighter. All powerful God. I seek you this morning. I stand in the gap for my family on, on TikTok, on Facebook, on YouTube. My God, I thank you, Holy Spirit. Place your anointing upon us, oh God. Somebody lay your right hand on your forehead, on your head like this, on your crown. And say, let your anointing rest on me, oh God. Place your anointing on me in Jesus' mighty name. God bless you. God bless those who are sharing. God bless all those who are following. God bless those who are praying. May the anointing of the Lord rest upon you in Jesus' mighty name. The anointing that is on your life, that you have just laid your hands on your head and you have prophesied that the anointing is resting on your head. That anointing is going to repel every diabolic assignment, every diabolic individual that was coming to harm you. I decree and I declare that you are protected in the beloved. In this month, you are resting. You are, he's your refuge. He's your protection. No harm shall come near your dwelling. No harm shall come near you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The Lord is lifting you up right now. No diabolic assignment shall, shall prosper. It cannot even stick on you because of the oil that is dripping on you in Jesus' mighty name. They will try and catch you, but you will be slippery in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, let the anointing that is uncontaminated, let the anointing that is uncontaminated, that is unhindered, fall upon our lives in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The anointing that is upon our lives for this season, let it empower us for the mission that you have for us, O oh God, the mandate that you have for us, O oh God. We decree that there is an anointing on our purpose that will help us to function and execute our purpose easily in Jesus' mighty name. And this anointing, my God, by this anointing, we will attract divine favor. We will attract our divinely ordained assignments. We will attract our divinely attracted spouses. Somebody who's believing for a spouse, pray right now and say, I receive my divinely appointed spouse in Jesus' mighty name. My divinely appointed contracts are coming my way in Jesus' mighty name. No harm shall come near your dwelling. No curse shall come on your children in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. 
Father, we ask that you place the anointing upon us, the anointing for intercessory prayer. In the month of July, we ask that you, you place on us the anointing for signs and wonders. You said your children are for signs and wonders. Therefore, Father God, let signs and wonders begin to follow us in this month of July. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, we receive the anointing for the miraculous. We receive the anointing for spiritual warfare. We receive the anointing for a purpose-driven life. We will not wander about in the month of July as if we are headless chickens without direction. Father God, direct our steps, order our steps, direct us, guide us, O Holy Spirit. Father, we receive the anointing of Solomon for resource management. We will manage our resources accordingly in the month of July. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, we receive. God bless you, lady man. We receive the anointing of Solomon for wisdom. Father, I decree and I declare that everybody who's at the sound of my voice, Lord, they are receiving the anointing for wisdom. The anointing of wealth will rest on you. The anointing of success will rest on you. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive the anointing of prosperity in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, we thank you, Lord, that in the month of July, all our investment strategies will be spot on. We receive the anointing of Isaac, O oh God, for proper investment strategies, O oh God, that we shall not fall for any scams, O oh God. Father, let every investment yield a triple fold, a hundredfold. My God, thank you, Jesus. Father, we receive the anointing for financial acumen. Lord, help us to manage our finances accordingly. We receive the anointing of Cyrus in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My God. Father, we receive the anointing of sensitivity to the anointing, their sensitivity for discernment, O oh God. The same anointing that re re resided on the, uh, on, the, on the prophet Samuel, O oh God. We receive it right now in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. We receive the anointing of Samuel. We will be sensitive and will be obedient to the voice of God. Somebody declare it. I receive the anointing to be sensitive and to be obedient to the voice of God. I will hear you clearly, O oh God. I will not mishear you. I will not miscalculate. I will not misbudget everything concerning my life. It will be strict according to the plans that you have for me in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we receive the Esther's anointing for divine favor and kingdom strategies. Father, I prophesy the anointing that was upon Queen Esther. Let it reside upon every single person who's at the sound of my voice right now in Jesus' mighty name. Father, the same way that you anointed Daniel, we receive that same anointing for governance and excellence and integrity, Father God. We will conduct our businesses with integrity. We will conduct our businesses with excellence. Our careers will be executed with excellence in everything that we do, God. We will go above and beyond expectation. And Father God, as we continue to go above expectation, we shall be noticed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My God, I thank you. The same way, Lord, you gave Joseph an anointing for political and business leadership and economic strategies. Father God, we receive the same anointing of leadership, oh God. Empower every single person who is a leader, my God, in their workplace and in their homes, oh God. Let them receive the anointing of leadership in Jesus' mighty name. Let them receive the anointing of leadership in Jesus' name. The leadership that will help them manage their businesses accordingly. Lord, those who you have positioned in political uh, departments, in government departments, Father God, may they represent you well. May Christ be represented with integrity in Jesus' mighty name. We receive success strategies, O oh God. The same success strategies that you gave to Joshua, O oh God. Let them be operational in our life. We receive the anointing for warfare, O oh God. The anointing for prosperity in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. The Bible says that Abraham was pioneering new territories. Everywhere he went, he was blessed in Jesus' mighty name. And so was his progeny. They were also blessed. Father, right now, I pray for an anointing to reside upon us, O oh God that we will pioneer new territories. We are taking over new territories. Lord, you are expanding our territories the same way you expanded the territories for Jabez. My God, Father, let us expand. Those of you who are in real estate, I hear the Holy Spirit says you will expand into real estate and you will grow. Your business will grow in Jesus' mighty name. 
Father, we activate intergenerational covenant blessings. Father God, the same blessings that resided on Abraham. Father God, we lay claim on it right now in Jesus' mighty name. We are covenant children, oh God, and therefore we reactivate and we activate, oh God, and we release these covenant ger generational blessings in the same way that you have blessed Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Lord, we are similarly blessed, oh God, and therefore, Father God, we, re we, we, we release the same covenant blessings to our children and our children's children in the name of Jesus Christ, my God. Father Moses decided to be the one that becomes the deliverer for Israel. He became a trailblazer. And therefore, Father God, I ask and I pray for the anointing of becoming a trailblazer in whatever industry, in whatever field that we are functioning in. Father God, whether we are medical doctors on this platform, whether we are nurses in everything that we are doing, we will be trailblazers. People will come to us and they will find the solutions because we have the answers to every question that will be asked. Oh, yes, oh God. Not only are we leaders, leaders but we are also trailblazers in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, you gave Nehemiah the anointing of being a restorer. Lord, help us to restore our families. Help us to bring innovation and renovation to any area that needs a renovation, a recreation, a creation, my God, in our lives. Help us to restore those things that were broken. Help us to restore sibling rivalry and disunity in families, oh God. In the month of July, we prophesy and we declare it, oh God, that our families will be united. They will move with peace and in one accord in the name of Jesus Christ. Husbands and wives, they are reconciling in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we receive the Deborah anointing for balance and rulership. Father, we thank you, Lord, that the spirit of worship and praise shall arise in us, the anointing of worship and praise, the same as it was in the King David. Father God, that anointing will reside on us in Jesus' mighty name. The Lord will anoint us for worship and praise like never before. Father God, may we exalt you and glorify you in everything that we do. Father, we give you thanks because if it was not for you, we would not be alive at this moment in Jesus' name. My God. Father, we receive the anointing for apostolic revelation, the same apostolic revelation that you gave to the Apostle Paul. Father God, I decree and I declare on my family on TikTok right now, on my family on Facebook and YouTube, they are receiving the anointing for apostolic revelation in Jesus' mighty name. My God. Father, upon this house, upon this family, this protocol breaking prayer altar family, Father God, I speak, Lord, cutting edge apostolic revelations. I speak Elijah's anointing of God for prophetic accuracy and insights in the name of Jesus Christ. I command, I prophesy, I decree, I declare it. There shall be prophetic accuracy and insight in every single person that is on this broadcast. Father God. Thank you for it. In Jesus' name, you will, re you will receive prophetic insight, not only from one way, but you will, God will show you in dreams in the month of July. Some of you will start seeing visions. Some of you need to tune your ear so that you can hear. Some of you will have to train yourselves and, and, and in interpretations. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. My God. Father, I thank you. The anointing for servanthood is taking root in everybody that is in this place. Everybody that was serving before, that served you before, God. Let that fervency of servanthood come back in them in Jesus' mighty name. In the month of July, we are refreshing, we are renewing our vows of servanthood in the name of Jesus Christ. The same way that Elisha served Elijah, Father God, we receive that same anointing, that servanthood heart, that leadership of servanthood. My God, we receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we receive the ministerial succession anointing, the double portion anointing, my God. Power and authority. We receive it right now in Jesus' mighty name.
Father, we thank you, Lord. I thank you for every single person that is represented here and every family member that is represented here, every husband that is represented here that might not be on this broadcast. Father God, I pray for discernment for correct times and seasons the same way, Lord, that you anointed the sons of Issachar that were able to tell the times and seasons. My God, let us not be able to miss our times and seasons. Let us not miss opportunities. Let us have the discernment to understand the times and seasons we are operating in in the name of Jesus Christ. Father God, I speak to every single person that is on this broadcast. Father God, anoint them with hospitality. Anoint them with prudence. Father, let Anna's anointing for intercession reside in us heavily in Jesus' mighty name. Father, we receive a technological advancement anointing, oh God. Let us be trailblazers, trendsetters, the same way like Queen Uzziah, oh God. Let us, let us be the innovators in our fields, oh God, bringing new technological advancement in Jesus' mighty name. We are taking over all the seven mountains, oh God. Christians shall be found in government. Christians shall be found in medicine. Christians shall be found in technology, in media. Everywhere we are taking over in Jesus' name. There's room for taking over. Taking over is allowed. We will pursue, we will overtake, and we'll, we will take over. You don't have to be apologetic. I always say, your best friend may wish the best for you, but they still want to be better than you. So what I'm saying, I'm encouraging you to overtake. Overtaking is allowed. Some, some people can, can receive a word and God gives them an assignment and they don't do it. And then you see somebody else and then you are in regret because somebody else is executing that. And you will say, but God told me to do the same thing three years ago. God told me to do the same thing three months. Do you understand that if you will not serve him, if you will not worship him, the rocks will worship him and they will execute that thing. So I pray for you this morning. I say that you will not be in regret. You will execute as you are hearing. You will move with speed. Everything that the Lord has positioned in your heart. In Jesus' mighty name. Yes, Pearl Gugu. The same Abigail anointing for hospitality and intercession will reside on you in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Holy Spirit. May we be students of the word, the same way the disciples were learning of Jesus. May we be prudent and, 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 and diligent in learning the word of God so that nobody can dupe us, nobody can tell us any otherwise as it is written, so that we can find out what is written of us, my God, what is written of us so that we can remain in the book of remembrance, that we don't fall out in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you. We receive the anointing of Jabez for territorial growth. We receive the anointing of Jabez for intellectual growth. Nobody's going to call us stupid. The same way as we are growing spiritually, the same way as he said in the third epistle of St. John, he says, Beloved, I wish above all things that you prosper and be in good health, even as your soul prospers. Let your brain also be expanded. Let your brain also be, be, be challenged. I speak to every single person. You've been thinking of whether you want to go back academically. This is a second semester or third semester. Go and register again. You may have been appointed and you did not qualify for that job, but thank God that God is going to qualify you. You're going to show them why you were appointed on that job. God is going to accelerate you and expand you intellectually. You're going to lead with class. You're going to lead as Christ led. Excellence shall be your portion. I speak to those of you who are managers, supervisors, those who are aspiring for those higher positions, those who are going to executive level positions. May God accelerate your promotions because your bosses would have seen the excellence within which you are, you are performing in the month of July. You will look after those businesses as if it is your business in Jesus' mighty name. You will celebrate others. You will help others in Jesus' name. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Father, we receive the fruitfulness and dominion anointing of Eve right now. Father, we prophesy, we declare that we have the anointing of fruitfulness and dominion in Jesus' mighty name. My God, cause the apostolic, cause the prophetic anointing to converge. When the apostolic and the prophetic converge, there shall be an explosion, there shall be a manifestation of life with accuracy in your life. 
I command that accuracy to manifest. I prophesy that explosion of authenticity, that clarity, that elegance in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody say, I'm perfected in Jesus Christ. Father, we take command, we take authority over this new month. We command it to be fruitful. We command it to be productive for us in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I decree that all the forces of nature will, will operate in our favor in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, I speak to the moon, the stars, and the sun. I command every element of nature that it will not work against us, but they will work for us in our favor in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. For my, Father God, I come against every plan of the enemy over our lives. I come against every plan over the, of the enemy against our family's life in this new month. In the name of Jesus Christ, I decree and I declare that their plans will not come to pass. The enemy's plans will not come to pass in the name of Jesus Christ in this month of, of July. The Lord will make you to rejoice. You will rejoice in every single day of this month of July. In everything that you will lay your hands on, I decree that it shall prosper in the name of Jesus Christ. I bless your hands right now in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You will rejoice and be glad in the month of July. No negative power, no negative energy shall come and work against you this month. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, as I stand in the gap, I declare and I decree that we take authority over any negative power and we decree that we have freedom in the name of Jesus Christ. We have, we have freedom in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We take authority over any negative power. Father, we decree that we are sitting on the head of the devil and we are in charge and he, can, he has no say in it. In Jesus' mighty name. Father, we retrieve out of the hands of the evil ones, out of the hands that are making satanic incantations for, for this month. Father God, we retrieve July out of their hands. We retrieve July out of their mouths in Jesus' mighty name. We decree that July shall work for us and it will not work for, against us. This new month, Father God, no satanic incantation, no satanic invasion shall prosper in the name of Jesus Christ. We are in control. We are in charge of our month in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, I decree and I declare that we will excel in everything that we will do in this month of July. We will excel in our academics. We will excel in our work, job situations. We will excel, my God, in our businesses. We will excel. My God, thank you, Lord, that you are bringing business ideas to many that have been sitting and jobless at home. Father, thank you for the resources that are coming through for them as well in Jesus' name. You are in charge and you are in control. This is your season. This is your turn. This is your time. Thank you, Jesus. My God, I command the favor of God to be before you, to be after you, to be beside you in this new month in Jesus' name. I declare and I decree that in your going out and in your coming in, you will be blessed in this new month. In the name of Jesus Christ, you will be the head and not the tail. You will lead. Nations are coming to your rising. Nations are coming to get solutions from you in Jesus' mighty name. Father, I prophesy that the spirit of constant wisdom shall operate in, the, in everybody who is at the sound of my voice. There shall be constant wisdom. constant might constant power you will not you you, you don't need to even ref, refuel your brakes or, or what, what is it batteries constant power you are moving with a high voltage anointing in the month of july hear me you will even see the acceleration in your prayer life high voltage high voltage do you understand that when electricians say that there's a high voltage they don't even want people in front of that thing they have to wear protective gear. They cannot touch it. That's how God is wiring you in the month of July. You are moving at the speed of light. You are moving at the speed of high voltage. 
in your prayer life, in everything that you will say, God is accelerating. Your authority is being restored in Jesus' mighty name. You don't have to doubt. He's not holding it against you. Whatever sin that you think you might have committed, he's not holding it against you. My God, God bless you, Kazmir. You will possess the gates of the enemy in the month of July. In the name of Jesus Christ. I decree and I declare that wherever they will say there is a casting down, you will shout celebration. Anybody who is shouting, uh, casting down, anybody who is sh shouting, I'm depressed, anybody who is shouting, I'm sad, you will say it is my season of celebration. Somebody type celebration. It's celebration time. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, men shall favor you. God has favored you. In this new month, no power of the enemy will overcome you. You will overcome every single power, every single manipulation of the evil one in Jesus' name. <coughs> no evil shall come near your dwelling. No evil shall come near your family in the name of Jesus Christ. The sun shall not smite thee by day or the moon by night in the name of Jesus Christ. My God, my God. The Lord Almighty is anointing you right now with the oil of joy and the oil of gladness. Receive the oil of joy and the oil of gladness right now in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This month of July, the enemy shall not overpower you. They shall not overpower you and they shall not overpower anybody close to you in Jesus' mighty name. Celebration is your portion, diamond. Noah, this is your season of celebration. You are perfected in Jesus. I decree and I declare that this month of July, you are only permitted to hear good news. You are only permitted to hear good news. You will not hear the voice of Christ in the name of Jesus Christ. You are permitted only to hear good news. Somebody declare it with me. I will only hear good news in the month of July. I will only hear good news in the month of July. I will only hear good news in the month of July. Father, you are wiping every form of crying in Jesus' mighty name. Crying is far from me. In this new month, I decree and I declare that you will be secure in Christ. You are hidden and protected in him in the name of Jesus Christ. You will continuously trust in the Lord in whatever you do. You will commit your plans to the Lord in whatever you do. And you will trust in his provision. You will trust in his excellence. You will trust that he will make sure that that thing will come to fruition to the level that you expected and even more. Ear has not heard, eye has not seen where the Lord is taking you in Jesus' mighty name. Oh, I prophesy that you will not be downgraded in this month of July in Jesus' mighty name. You will not be downgraded in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The Lord will favor you in the eyes of men in Jesus' name. The Lord will favor you himself and he will cause men to favor you in Jesus' mighty name. I speak favor. I command favor. Everybody that you will meet will see you, that you are shining and favor will be oozing out of every pore on your skin in Jesus' mighty name. You will walk in favor. You will sleep in favor. Doors will open up for you. Doors will even open up from your enemy's side. They have no choice. By the anointing of the Holy Ghost. I decree and I declare, you will have favor with men. I decree and I declare, that you will not work in vain. Your labor shall not be in vain. Every work that you will do, everybody will pay on time. There shall be no credit in the month of July. I prophesy, I call forth everybody who's owing you money right now. Father, let them begin to lose sleep. Torment everybody who has been owing us. Our finances are being settled urgently speedily anybody who is owing you money has to pay you speedily in the month of july they will not sleep until they settle you in the month of july there shall be no credit in fact you will have repeat customers thank you jesus 
I decree and I declare that you will walk in victory in the month of July. You will definitely walk in victory in July month. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I decree and I declare you are a winner and not a loser. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, it is settled. You will be a candidate of unusual testimonies. I prophesy unusual testimonies. Say it with me. I'm a candidate. God bless you, Zwa. Zwabu. You are a candidate for uncommon testimonies, unusual testimonies. I, 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 I'm going to share this. I don't know if Ruzani is on the platform on Sunday in church. She said, Pastor, I'm getting embarrassed because it's like every week I've got a testimony. And this week she was sharing a promotion testimony. She says, I've got a promotion from work. That is the kind of unusual testimonies. Don't be shy. If you have to testify every week, why not? If something new, if God is doing something good, guys, there's, when, when, when you give him thanks, he swells up and he wants to do more. He says, wow, David is loving on me. Lillian is loving on me. Figile is loving on me. I need to do more. It's like that testimony that you gave is not enough. Juliet, he's giving you an unusual testimony. He says, let me do more for Juliet. Let me see what she will say to me this week. Let me do more for Pell. If I do more for any, she will worship me. She will praise me. She will tell others of me. She will tell them that I'm a good father. I'm a good, good father in Jesus' mighty name. Brenda, he's waiting on you to love on him, to brag on him. And the fact that you even woke up this morning, did you praise him enough for that? Did you glorify him enough for that? Some didn't make it. Some are in ICU. Some, some are busy giving out their life. That they're giving up their spirit right now. And me and you are here. My God. You are here for a reason. You survived for a reason. You survived COVID for a reason. You are still here. My God. Some didn't make it. And you made it, Juliet. So we don't complain. We don't say, oh God, why did you preserve us? We are suffering. No, 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 no. There are people that wanted to be here. My God. I'm a candidate of unusual testimony. Somebody declare it. I'm a candidate for unusual testimonies in Jesus' mighty name. I'm a winner. I'm not a loser in Jesus' mighty name. I declare and I decree I'm a winner. I'm not a loser. The Lord will continue to glorify himself through you in Jesus' mighty name. The Lord will continue to showcase himself through you to the world. Do you understand that he does not get glorified if you are shamed? Therefore, he says, there's no way I can allow shame to torment you. I cannot allow reproach on your life because you are my showcase to the world. You are my business plan. You are my, you are my prized possession. So you got to work. You got to shine. It is in my interest as God that you must shine. It is my interest as God that you must win. It is in my interest as God that your marriage should work because they need to know that it is a sanctified union joined by God. My God, my God. I'm a candidate for unusual testimonies. Thank you, sons. God bless you. You survive for a reason, Frida. Don't tire until you know it. Don't tire until you execute that reason in Jesus' mighty name. I'm a winner. Victory, victory, victory all the way. Victory all the way. The Lord will glorify himself through showcasing you through the, to the world. Even when you step out, if you even, when you're going to the shops to even buy bread, I want you to dress up. Those of you who are saying, I'm waiting on God. I'm, I'm, I'm I've taken delivery of my job. My job is coming. Dress up as if you're going to work. Yes, to go and buy bread. Yes, to go bribe milk. Yes. Dress like the way you are going. Dress like the way you're going, where you're going. Dress like your destiny. Hallelujah, somebody. Don't say I'm at home. I'm just, no, 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 no. Dress like the way you're going. Those of you who have been waiting for those praises and you want that romance and that romance to be ignited. 
I come against the spirit of wearing those, uh, what do you call those things? Those ones that we made popular on TikTok. Dress the way you want to be seen. Hallelujah. Tantalize your husband. Tantalize, even husbands. They say it is good manners to smell good. So even if you are a man, don't say I'm smelling like a man. You must also smell good for your wife. Be hygienic. Represent yourself. Set a template for your children. Don't let your children catch you. Even if you have a misunderstanding and you have a disagreement, you don't agree on how to approach whatever is happening, you will do it in your private place in your bedroom. Am I communicating? We are dressing for destiny. Amen. We are dressing for destiny. We are dressing the way we want to be addressed. We are dressing the way we want to be addressed. Some of you who are believing for marital settlement, don't be caught and say, no, no, I don't look like this usually. No. Let's put effort. Can, 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 we, can we accelerate the month of July? Let's put effort. Let's upgrade. Don't say, Pastor Fortune, I don't have the clothes. No, 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 no. The same ones. The ones you have. Even if you have to wash them every single day. Even if you have, you have to make sure you are not smelling, make sure they are clean. You iron them. If you don't iron them, it's fine. Wear them like that. Practice where you're going. We are living a purposeful life in July. Perfected purposefully. My God. Thank you, Jesus. You are a winner. You are not a loser. You will have no reason to cry. I prophesy to you in the month of July, you will have no reason to be sorrowful. You will have no reason to cry, Facebook. You will have no reason to be sorrowful, YouTube. I cancel every appointment with tragedy that you have. Any appointment that you are thinking you are going to meet up with tragedy, with crying, with weeping, it is canceled in the name of Jesus Christ. It's not in your diary anymore. You're not going to find it. I've just canceled it. So if you were planning a pity party, it ain't happening. You have stepped into perfection month. No more sorrow. No more weeping. No more crying. Every appointment with tragedy, every appointment with trauma, cancelled. Anybody who's been verbally, mentally, or, or physically abusive, you tell them if they try and call you. You say, no, appointment cancelled. You are no longer in my phone book anymore. You're no longer welcome in my space. Because no longer will I be in a relationship where I'm tolerated. I will be celebrated. This is my month of celebration. So I will not tolerate your abuse. I will not tolerate you talking to me anyhow. Because my father loves me that much and more. You are not welcome. Press delete, delete, delete. Delete any negative energy from anybody. Anybody who's just bringing you stress. Delete, delete, delete. You are not obligated to honor invitations of people that just, just to say, make as if you are just fitting in. No, 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 no. If that network is not going to increase your net worth, you are not going. If it's not increasing your net worth, you are not going. Simple. I'm busy. No, I'm resting. I'm studying. I don't need to explain myself more than that. You don't need to, 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 I speak strength to you, Kenesha. In Jesus' mighty name, may the Lord strengthen you. I decree that you will laugh this month of July. Somebody say, I shall laugh this month. I shall laugh. Laughter shall be filled in my mouth. The Lord is going to fill your mouth with laughter in Jesus' mighty name. Laughter shall not cease from your mouth in Jesus' mighty name. You will laugh in every, every area of your life in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. You are not a candidate of robberies. You are not a candidate of tragedies. You are not a candidate of weeping. In the name of Jesus Christ, I decree that you will be favored. Even your enemies have no choice but to favor you. You are a candidate of celebration. You are a candidate of unusual testimonies in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Jesus. God is going to cause you to be completely immune. Father, we speak immunity. 
any disease, any sickness, immunity right now, God. Inject in us through the blood of Jesus immunity against diseases, immunity against sicknesses in Jesus' mighty name. Somebody say sickness is not my portion. As I step into July, sickness is not my portion in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, envelope the members of my family, envelope the members of my colleagues, my friends with your love. Shield us from every kind of oppression in the name of Jesus Christ. Any oppression of the enemy, we are shielded from it in Jesus' mighty name. In the month of July, you are shielded from oppression. Your family is shielded from oppression. You are enveloped in Jesus' mighty name. Father, I cover our going in and our coming out in this new month with the blood of Jesus Christ. The protection of the blood is on us in Jesus' mighty name. The protection of the blood is on our families in Jesus' mighty name. Father God, thank you, Lord, for making us a shining example to others in this new month of, G of July. The Lord is going to make you a shining example in Jesus' mighty name. I decree and I declare that throughout the month of July, you will be celebrated. The Lord will make you the head and not the tail. No plague shall come near your dwelling. All snares and the fowler against you shall perish in the name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy in your life right now that every power of darkness that has been assigned against you in the name of Jesus Christ, I nullify it in Jesus' mighty name. Noah on Facebook, I nullify it in Jesus' name. Every power of darkness, Brenda, is nullified in the name of Jesus Christ. It is void. Oh my God. Ah, the comments are too fast. My screens are moving too fast. Even those of you on YouTube receive in Jesus mighty name. Zodwa. It is your month of celebration in Jesus name. You are the head and not the tail. Indeed. In the name of Jesus. I'm with you. I know you're there. Hallelujah. Any snare, all, snare all, all snares of the fowler against you shall perish in the name of Jesus Christ. The oil of favor and fruitfulness shall be upon your life. I decree and declare the oil of favor and fruitfulness is upon your life in Jesus' mighty name. You will not work without results. God bless you, sons. God bless you and increase you. Thank you so much for those who are gifting. Thank you for those who are partnering. Thank you for those who are who are who are joining the subscription. Every support. Thank you so much. God bless you. Hallelujah. You will work and you will have results. You will not work without results in this month. In Jesus' mighty name. Thank you for everybody. Thank you for the followers. I see you on Mara Official there as well. God bless you. Hallelujah. Yes, he has prepared a table for you in the presence of your enemies, Julia. In the name of Jesus Christ, I celebrate you, woman. I celebrate you, woman. You will have results. You will not labor in vain. Every obstacle on your way to progress shall be damaged in the name of Jesus Christ. Every obstacle, I damage it. Every obstacle, I damage it. I remove it. I annihilate it. I obliterate it in Jesus' name. Oh my God, somebody shout, oh Lord, arise. Lord, arise and scatter in the name of Jesus anything that is a stubborn pursuer. Who is that stubborn pursuer pursuing you? Oh God, arise, pursue my pursuers. Any stubborn pursuer that is pursuing me, pursue them on my behalf in Jesus' mighty name. I will not have to fight in this battle. I will laugh. And those who scorn me will celebrate with me. You will laugh. God bless you, Silius. Those who scorned you will celebrate with you. They would have no choice. Even if they are sitting there and they are clapping as if they are making as if they are clapping, but that deep down inside, something is eating them. Let it eat them inside. The result is that the submarine is coming out. This is, this is the month of July. The Lord is wanting to show you off a bit. He says the submarine is coming out. My God. You've been hidden too long. You will laugh. Those that have scorned you will laugh. And they will celebrate you. They have no choice. They will have to celebrate with you. Thank you, Almighty Father, for granting us the answers to the prayers of this new month, of this new month of July. In Jesus' mighty name. The submarine is coming out. And it's not that other submarine that has been trending. Hallelujah. You are a city set upon a hill. You cannot be hid hidden. 
your flavor shall be felt in this new month in Jesus mighty name the Lord is increasing your territory the Lord is expanding your territory father I thank you for every single person that is tuned in this morning on this broadcast father I thank you Lord that everything that they are believing you for my God, they have declared, they've decreed, they've stood with me. They have weathered the storm. They have been here the whole night, my God. Father, I seal every declaration. I seal every promise. I seal every testimony, every healing that has taken place, Father God. Every confirmed prophetic word, my God. In Jesus' mighty name, I command the explosion I command the explosion to happen in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' mighty name, the explosion of favor, the explosion of favor on every side, explosion of favor, you will possess your possessions in the name of Jesus Christ. God bless you. I want to say thank you to everybody on Facebook and on YouTube. You know I'm with you tomorrow, 5 a.m., right? Tomorrow is Sunday. Today is Saturday, right? So tomorrow is Sunday. We are back again at 5 a.m. South African Standard Time. Make sure you realign your time zone. Make sure you follow the host account that you're on so that you can see me again. There will be a 10 p.m. session, teaching session with Apostle. I don't know whether he's teaching on dreams or he's teaching on prayer, but there will be another session at 10 p.m. with Apostle Mara. Those of you on Apostle Mara's account, please make sure you follow me as well, Fortune L Online. I will definitely make sure that I put my handle there. Make sure you follow me on YouTube if you want to rewatch. If you want to download my YouTubes, you are more than welcome. It's free. Download them. Make them into MP3s. Listen to them as much as you want. And let them be a blessing in your life. God bless you. I love you, my darling family. Have an awesome, 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 awesome Saturday. Make sure you get some rest. Make sure you have lunch with your family. And make sure you tell your children you love them. Make sure you tell your spouse that you love them. Make sure you call your parents and tell them you love them. Amen and amen. Bye Facebook, bye YouTube.